show facts and trivia. Appreciate you being here. Um, uh, um, uh, um, I ask you to please subscribe. I ask you to please share these out with your friends. And I, uh, please share them on all your social network if you don't mind. If you got Instagram or if you got, uh, Twitter, put them out there for me. Today is day five of the contest. We'll let you know later in the video how to enter uh, to win this beautiful throw blanket with a picture of Andy, Barney, and Opie. And it's really soft. I haven't, I haven't taken it out of the package, but I can feel how soft it is. Do you want to see it? Okay, we'll see. Here it is. Okay. Uh, today, uh, I always wondered about the actual relationship between Andy and uh, Francis Bavier, who we all know apparently wasn't very wasn't a very good relationship. Um, but I always wondered how far, how bad it really was. So I kind of looked this up, and I thought you guys would be interested in hearing it. Um, uh, though they were loving and supportive on the show, um, Andy and Francis just didn't do along. Um, there, I did it again. Uh, their tensions have been well documented, but even cast members were aware of it, of the feud um, when the cameras weren't rolling. Even Ron Howard's father, Rance, soon suspected that the two actors didn't like each other. Uh... Ron Howard played Opie on the show and often interacted with both, so he would see this also. Uh, Howard's father remembered the exchange between Jim Neighbors, who played Gomer, and Andy Griffith. Neighbors came to Bobby A's defense after Griffith criticized the actor. Jim Neighbors counted Francis as a dear friend. Rance said in Andy and Don, making a friendship and a classic American TV show, one day on the set, Andy muttered something under his breath about Francis, and I remember we were walking back from the table reading on our way to the soundstage, and I heard Jim say, not loudly, but he said, Andy, she's a good actress. You be nice to her. And Andy had no reply. Even Ron Howard, uh, who was just a kid, remembered an unspoken tension between the two. The actor turned future director remembered Bobby A. keeping to herself. Uh, she kept to herself. Howard told the uh, Archive of American Television in 2006, Frances very much kept to herself. She was a New York stage actress, and I think she always loved the job and appreciated it was a big success and was extremely professional. But I don't think she ever felt a part of what the boys were up uh, to and their shenanigans. But Howard and Bobby A. remained friends until her death. He had nothing but positive things to say about her and their time on the show together. Finally, Griffith and Bobby A. also ended their feud. Uh, they finally made amends before she died in 1989. Uh, over a phone call, the two forgave each other and were able to part on amicable terms. I think well, actually what happened was Bobby A. called Andy Griffith, and she apologized, and he did. I mean, he, he made attempts to see her, and she wouldn't see him. So it's, it's good to know that uh, they did finally makeup. It's just a shame it didn't happen before, say, uh, the reunion, the, the Andy Griffith uh, return to Mayberry, because it would have been wonderful to see her on there as well. Well, that's all I got for you on this. Um, did it again? Let's uh, figure out how we're going to enter to win the uh, how to, we're gonna enter to win the contest today. So, Let's think. I didn't even come up with this before. I was on this too fast. I had to have to do this morning. Um, tell you what. <laughs> as a joke, go through the video and count how many times I said um. No, nah, we're not going to do that. Which is your absolute favorite episode of the Andy Griffith Show? 
your absolute favorite, one that you could watch over and over and over and over again. So let me down, know down in the comments below, and remember, you have to be subscribed to win, so subscribe now if you haven't yet. And then come Sunday at 9 p.m. Eastern, I'm going to quit taking entrance. So, uh, probably drawing on Sunday night or Monday morning. Okay? Have a great day. We'll see you tomorrow. Don't forget the trivia question on the Facebook page. And God bless. Thank you.